Hey, it's Aaron, and today we'll be going through the solution for the Priceless Puzzle Series number two, Pearl. This puzzle is a level seven on the Puzzle Master difficulty scale. This puzzle and many others are available at puzzlemaster.ca. So we have this nice luminous ball. It, uh, it has two halves. And we also have these nubs that are trying to be hidden, but they're not very hidden. We can see that we can rotate them out. So this puzzle is you're attempting to crack it in half. So it will break like that and then we'll be able to pull it apart. There are two ball bearings internally stopping us from doing that. These two, well, this shaft that goes through here is actually two pieces held together with a magnet and they have screws upon their bases close to the center. They also have grooves in them for accepting the ball bearings. So to begin, we are going to just rotate one all the way out. If we hear a thunk, we're lucky. If we don't, whatever. So I'm not sure we did. So I'm just going to, yeah, I can feel that both ball bearings are sliding side by side. So I'm just going to, with my one finger, I'm going to hold on to this side because it's not held in by any screws. And I'm going to rotate this side in, but it's not rotating this piece because I'm holding on to it. And then when I go to rotate this back, I will do that and that will rotate my shaft. I can feel that the ball bearing is up here. So once the slot moves into position, it should drop in and I'll hear it and feel it. I can only feel the one ball bearing on this side, so I probably have it. So I'm going to rotate it out. And we want to hold it in position so we don't accidentally drop it in and rotate the ball instead of the shaft. And then we'll rotate the other way. Now we will just, and we can see our ball bearing. We will figure out just by haptic feedback where our ball bearing is. It's up here and we can see a dark spot. So we'll rotate. Now the downside is it's possible that you might accept the ball bearing immediately and then rotate it and drop it into the bottom. So if you hear a big thunking, you can't feel it back and forth. You know it's probably at the other side, but we're still good. I feel it on top. And I guess small increments is probably better than large ones. You might overstep it. And every once in a while you can just... And actually it feels like none of them are moving. So I must have got it when I... that little thunk. So we'll rotate it back. And... I should be good. No, I got a ball bearing still here. Okay, so we rotate it. Okay, this one's empty. We'll hopefully not lose all our progress. This one is full, that's good. Where's our ball bearing at? It's on this side. 
Rotate in a little bit. Holding this, letting go. Ooh, that sounded good. We'll take it back to the center. Huh, still not opening. <laughs> I guess it didn't just sound that good. Oh, we still got this ball bearing, which is good. Where is the... Okay, so we must have caught it and then dropped it. Oddly enough, it sounds like we caught it again. So we'll just hopefully return to the middle. And we did get it. Okay, so we'll leave the ball bearings out while I explain. So we have this white shaft, we have the magnets holding it. So when we're all the way, all the way screwed in on one side, it lines up. Wow, the exposure though. Uh, there we go. Our hole there lines up with this. So if it's not lined up, we rotate back, hold it in position, or we uh, hold it while we're rotating out, and then hopefully we're just repeating that over and over again, hoping that we line up at some point enough that it lines up with our hole. So that's all there is really to it. Putting it back together, we just take our pieces, might as well join them together, put them like so, load them up with the ball bearings. Drop one. Goes like this and together. And then we will go to one side like we did before. And that sounded like it dropped in. So, and I can feel it. And now we want to get the other one. And I just heard it drop. So we go back to center. I can feel both rolling around. So this is completely locked. Well, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, we have plenty more like it on our YouTube channel. Haven't had enough? Join our community on Facebook or Instagram. Want more puzzles? We have a massive catalog of puzzles at puzzlemaster.ca. Mm -hmm.